breaking news. And that breaking news is on Des Moines north side. You're looking live at a DOT traffic camera video. Crews fighting fire at the Montana Mike Steakhouse on northeast 14th, just north of I-3580. The fire has been burning for more than an hour now. KCCI's Laura Terrell and Todd Megal are both on the scene live. Let's start with Todd. Todd, what can you tell us? Steve and Stacy, this is a big fire. It's the biggest one I think we've seen in a long time. Take a look behind me. You can see ladder trucks from Des Moines Fire Department and other area fire departments are still spraying tons of water on the roof of what used to be Montana Mike's Steakhouse. It appears that the fire has destroyed uh, this restaurant here just about a block north of Interstate 3580. We're technically just on the very north edge of Des Moines and so Des Moines Fire Department got the first call from they believe a passerby that called 911. The uh, Polk County dispatchers called Des Moines uh, Fire. They arrived soon. They sent uh, their crews in to the restaurant at first thinking maybe they could contain this fire. They thought they'd be okay. Then they started to probe the roof just above the ceiling inside the restaurant. It was completely engulfed in flames. So they turned around immediately, got out of the restaurant, uh, said they could not stay inside. It was too uh, unsafe. That's when they called in all the ladder trucks. And as you can see, there's ladder trucks from Des Moines, I believe maybe uh, Ankeny is here, Johnston is here, uh, several, about five different fire departments are on the scene here. Um, they don't know what caused the fire. Of course, it is a restaurant. Things always turn to kitchens and things like that, but the investigator has not been able to get inside because it's still too dangerous. Uh, we saw smoke when we were downtown when this actually started miles into the sky, uh, and now that smoke has turned from black to white to gray. That's a good sign that they've gotten a pretty good handle on the fire. One thing that people should realize, uh, Northeast 14th here, as you can see, is shut down the southbound lanes just north of the interstate because of all the fire hoses and the crews on the street. However, they just opened the northbound lanes of Northeast 14th going north, and uh, you can actually get through now. Those have been closed for about an hour right when we got out here. So we did talk to the spokesman for the Des Moines Fire Department. He says at this point they'll be here a long time because you can see there's still a lot of smoke and uh, fire to put out, but nobody's injured. Fire department's out. Nobody in the restaurant that we are knowing of that was uh, injured at this point, and so everybody's safe. So just keep in mind if you're in this area, a lot's going on here on Northeast 14th, just north of the interstate. Stephen Stacy. God, thank you very much. KCCI's Laura Terrell, also live on the scene of this fire. Uh, Laura, where are you in relation to Todd, and what are you seeing? Steve, we are on the completely other side of Northeast 14th, on the other side of the restaurant. As Todd, you can see behind me, firefighters are focused now on putting out hot spots. They said that that's the stage that they're at right now. Obviously, the big flames are gone. The massive cloud of smoke that we saw when we first got here around 4 o'clock is now gone, but the focus is on hot spots. The good news, obviously, as Todd said, everyone got out. Everyone's okay. Initial reports were that there were some people inside and everyone is okay. We talked with uh, firefighters here just about two minutes before we went on, and Lieutenant Thomas told us he was trying to find the people that were inside that got out safely so he could talk to them and get some information from them. He was working on that. We also talked to the restaurant owner's sister off camera. Uh, as you can imagine, the family is very emotional. Um, they were kind of in shock as they're standing here watching the building burn. Uh, we saw some tears. We saw some hugs. They obviously were not up for doing an interview, but were gracious and talked with us and said that this is just devastating to them. So no idea of a cause just yet. Firefighters say it's way too early to figure out exactly what caused this. Uh, but they will be on the scene for a very long time. And as Todd mentioned, uh, the biggest fire we've seen in quite a while, several departments. We saw Taylor, Sailor Township. We saw Ankeny, Altoona, Des Moines. Lots of agencies here fighting this fire. So we will continue to monitor it and bring you the latest updates as they become available. But for now, reporting live in Des Moines, Laura Terrell, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's news leader.
you to both Laura and Todd. Here's one last live look from a traffic cam up in the area. This is a traffic cam at I-3580 in uh, Northeast 14th. As you can see, steam now rising from the scene, but earlier this afternoon, billowing black smoke and lots of flames. Steam means they have that fire under control. You can count on KCCI for instant updates on this breaking news from our free mobile app and throughout this newscast. So